what's happening to tell you exactly what's happening welcome back to another video uh it's that time of the week stock more stock all of this is literally all listed on ebay um already since listing this afternoon this tran truck straight away is gone and this robot has gone within minutes robots literally always selling uh excuse the mess over in the background that's literally the boxes for this stuff so i can just take them upstairs into the office and the spare rooms where they can be stored um, but yeah, selection again, always a bit of selection, something for every budget. And I'm just going to do a little bit of a video talking you through why I've chosen what I have and what exactly they are. This, this is awesome, isn't it? Come on, look at that. Fully working, battery operated, walks along, and also it blows air out of there so the polystyrene ball will stay blowing up in the air. Bit of magic, that's some Houdini stuff there. Awesome. We've got this, um, I didn't even know, right, literally. It looks like a forklift when you look at the back and it was some sort of um dozer not dozer sorry um, uh, pickup truck and grab it on there that's yeah something different than anyway, original paint all different colors all fully working on the features as well which is quite cool it's got levers absolutely everywhere different levers do different things so that's quite neat you can even tip that forward over there ready to tip the front on it which is cool mercedes look at this bends i absolutely love that how cool is that that's awesome, SLs, love them. Bandai Rolls Royce. As you know, Bandai, even though I'm old in Rolls Royce, Bandai is like the Rolls Royce of template. Literally, it's the best, it's what you can get, it's what people want. That's lovely, isn't it? Badge still on it as well. Awesome. And this Continental, wow. Just look at that. Not too many of these on eBay as well, and this is in stunning condition in all fairness. That's quite nice, that's there. Then we've got the Wild West white uh, vibes even, the Pioneer, that's absolutely stunning. You know, I love the old like Wells Fargo style stuff, the coaches, the Wild West stuff. Brilliant, grew up watching all the Wild West movies with my gramps, so I can relate to it. And we've got a very, very clean Triang um, grab sort of thing, it's not a crane. I made a mistake saying that it's a crane, but it's not, someone corrected me. But it's like a bucket scoop thing, all fully working. Has doors on the back as well, which you can open up. And you can see the levers are in there. That's awesome. The condition on that, absolutely stunning. And we've got the old talking robot. You know, it's, it's there. It's a little bit worn, a little bit faded, but that's why I put up for 115 quid, I think it was. And within minutes, it sold because the only other ones are 300 upwards. You know, price everything for condition. Same with this Triang truck. If that was mint, what's that going to be? 400 quid easily. Put up for 250 quid in that sort of condition. Like that, gone which is quite nice. Then we've got some Salido stuff. Got a factory sealed D-Day 40th anniversary set. So 44 to 1984, that's quite nice. American set as well for the money. That's, you know, I said it's only like 30, 35 quid. It's a lot of money, you know, it's not a lot of money for a great model, great set. Over in the background, we've got more James Bond. Literally, they can't stop selling them, which is a good thing. On eBay, literally in the last week alone, I've sold another 12 or 13 of them. So. They're all brand new workshop stock coming out. France tank, this again, battery operated. I can't test it because it's literally that old school sort of batteries. Top comes off, bottom comes off on it as well. I know I've done that the wrong way around, but there we go. Uh, squeeze that out and yeah, it's like a square battery, one on the top, one on the bottom. You can't buy them anywhere. So it's more of a display item unless you do have one of them somewhere. So I don't know. Now I'm gonna take you through to this. This is cool. It's like some grand national vibes, isn't it? Um, amazing <laughs> mechanic guys drop. Trotting horse, look at that. Swansea as well, so South Wales, Lewis Marks, toys, original box, quite nice. They're serious, and he does wind him up, and he just goes along, keys in the side of him. But this is the rider, I guess, me. How it's like two different things you get, well, you're getting your money worth, I suppose, isn't you? Look at your other side, you got two different models. Madness. But that's there, and we've got some tin plate stuff as well down the front. Cute little thing, clock. Look, this is nice. What I love about this, look, two sparks. I think that's awesome, that's quite nice. Oh, need him there. Right through as well then to the dinky. I've held this onto this for a little while, waiting for a box for it. It's absolutely mint, but I thought, you know what? Let's give it a go, let's get it for sale. It's on there. That's mint, that's absolutely stunning. Original Corgi. Dublos, mint, mint. Budgie patrol car, mint. Phones, stunning. Dug these other people are crying out for dinky. So I thought, you know what? Let's pop them on. So this is quite nice, that's a green one, in there, lovely condition. And the tanker's my favourite out of these. Just look at that, blue tanker, silver stripe on it. Ah, oh, sorry, blue uh, flash on it, sold the one with the silver flash. Just 
look at that condition. You know, mid 50s. Absolutely stunning. They found a bit earlier, actually, aren't they? Last, yeah, tight ones. Oh, what's tight one? 1949 to about 54, 55, top of my head. Then obviously that's when the Type 2 come in then. Different carb on it. Quite a nice example. Yeah, it's got a little bit of rubbing on this side. Decals all there on that side. It's nice, you know? Bit of um, corrosion on the base there. Just from where it's been stored. But these are from the big dinky collection that I bought. Go back before lockdown. So come back the start of March. So these are original one owner stuff. Which is quite nice. These are, oh, honestly, these are so, look how crisp that is. They are so mint. They're the best you'll ever get. Right through to this then, you might be thinking, where's the screen on that, George? The screen is right here in the plastic bag, keeping it safe, because with a feature of it, the screen has to come off every time you want to get it in the box. I'm not joking with you. Look how narrow that box is. So the screen has to go off every time you put it in there. So artwork on that, amazing as well. You know, it's a great thing. It's not a lot of money. To be honest with you, all this stuff, that's not a lot of money, but it's stunning. Absolutely stunning. Even the loose stuff. Starting to pull out some really, really clean loose stuff for you all. Just look at that. Stunning. The Trojan van as well. There's all different. Every single livery of this is on the eBay store at the minute. So head on over when you still can. You know, going to racing car. Nice. It's just some general nice stuff. Even these are nice. Little sit around trucks. Pre-war as well. Clockwork, tipping backs. Fully working. Threw to a little bit of uh, JDM vibes in there, which is quite cool. So that's Jordan's Vintage World. Link in the description below. Or just Google Jordan's Vintage World. And you will find all of this stuff and hundreds and hundreds of more. And there's the stuff being listed every single week, and that's going to continue to right up till past Christmas, no doubt. So stay tuned, because there's some incredible stuff to come. So until next time, big love from me. Head on over. I forgot to show you that, but there we go. You can see it very quickly there. Bandai fully working. That's nice tips as well. And uh, I'll catch up with you all soon. So big love. Ta-ra now.